right, guys, so this is your cool down. You're stretching at the end of a workout. I want you to make sure that you get these in at the end of every workout as well. So just like in your warm-ups, we did scorpions, but we're gonna do them for a cool down and we're gonna hold the stretch longer this time. Okay, so you're gonna come back in that position, arms and T, big roll, big reach, and you're gonna hold it for eight to 10 counts on each side. Okay, so there, and then I'm gonna roll to the other side, get as big as I can, and hold that. Okay, so eight to 10 counts on each side. If you need to do it a couple times on each side, again, use your discretion in what your body is telling you that day. Okay, the next one that you're gonna do is you're gonna come up onto your hands and your knees. You're gonna thread your arm underneath the, the other one, and I'm gonna lay down until I feel a good stretch across the back of this shoulder right here. So I'm gonna come in here and roll back on that shoulder till I feel a good stretch. Then I'm gonna work on walking my other hand over and really rotating those shoulders and letting it pull. Again, you wanna hold this for eight to 10 counts. Then I'm gonna come out of that one and switch sides. Take it under, roll it back till I feel a good stretch, and then walk that hand over. All right, so we're gonna do those. When you're done with that, you're gonna have a seat on your butt. I'm gonna turn kind of an angle so it's better. I'm gonna cross my ankle over my knee. I'm going to scoot my butt as tight to my heel as I can. I wanna sit up as tall as I can. I wanna keep my hips on the floor. I wanna press my shoulders back and have my chin up. That's going to deepen the stretch in the outside of this hip right here. And it's also gonna keep your glutes open. So we're gonna stay here and we're gonna stretch and you're gonna push on this knee and hold that for 10 counts, release it, switch it out, cross it over, scoot it tight. Ooh, and my legs are tight today, right there, and hold that for eight to 10 counts, okay? When you're done with that, I want you to take have, have a seat on the floor, soles of your feet together, grab those toes, sit up nice and tall, pull up on the toes, press down into your shoulder blades, and press those legs towards the floor. So I'm decompressing up here, Pressing down right here and opening up that inside thigh. So right here and hold that for eight to 10 counts. Okay, and then I want you to give me that good old hamstring stretch. One leg in, one leg out. Try and keep that knee down. If you have trouble reaching your toes, take a hand towel, wrap it around your foot and pull yourself in. But I'd rather you focus on getting that leg straight than touching your toes. So this is not doing us much good. So if I look like this, my leg's straight, but I can only get to right here, no problem. Just keep working till you progress and can hit those toes. And you're gonna do that for eight to 10 counts on each side. 